Hello, I'm Sidos Luis Nogueira Serrano, President of the European Mobile Society, and we are here at Homo Dojo in Valencia, Spain. Uh, today, uh, I would like to share with you, uh, in this video, some classical techniques regarding a more advanced torite. Remember that torite were the techniques employed by the samurai that has the purpose to control, to restrain the, the enemy as a law enforcement. Uh, in this case, we will, uh, we will be uh, treating what it's called Yoso Jime. This Yoso comes from, uh, it means the, to anticipate, anticipation, or to, to take in advantage. And uh, Jime comes from the verb Simeru. This Simeru means uh, to lock. Then uh, in both, the both idea, it's when the enemy is trying to draw, we will take, we will anticipate the draw and we will perform very hard techniques of restriction. And it's, we are dealing on a more advanced, a more okuden, more deep studies concerning this story. In this case, we will have uh, here on my left, uh, Sensei Rebecca Roca, and uh, she will help me uh, staying on Seiza position with, a, uh, in this case, a Bokuto with Saya on the, uh, on the belt on the left side, and we'll remain on Seiza, please. In this case, uh, the idea, uh, the main idea is when I am uh, getting into the, the short range, uh, she will try, we will do it very slowly as a demonstrative uh, purpose and uh, she will try to draw very slowly as I am saying because the first thing what I will do is strike him with both teisho in the, in, the, in, in the face and more in the eye or the temple area as a way to stop. Take a look that at the same time I am getting close in order to avoid her to draw. Of course she could try to draw on a vertical line on Tatenuki and this is why the following movement will be to avoid this that we will be doing is like a chess or a, or a go uh, game trying to avoid all angles, all uh, possibilities to escape or, or possibilities to, to draw the technique and be in a dangerous, a risky position for myself. Then, in this case, I will go a strike, and this is why I cross here. I could grab here, grab on the Tatsuki if we have, because in this position it will be very difficult for her trying to draw the sword in a vertical line, because I am controlling here, and it's very difficult to, to do it. After this, it's the main characteristic of this yoso yime. This yoso yime uh, usually uh, avoids the way to go up, to, to, to raise the legs as a way to escape. How I will do it? A stepping with my, with my foot over, over, uh, over the, the, the muscle here of the legs with the idea of having this control. From here, what I will do is I will move having control on this right leg, that it's the one. If we don't have, after the choke here, if we don't have control, we could strike in order to have this control and move here to this position. This makes a strong torsion of the, sorry, a strong torsion here that it's very painful and very restrictive. From here, what we will do is to perform uh, with the ropes uh, a control here, having the, here the rope, lace, going here, passing to this side, and after here, we could grab the other hand and having the both controls here. This is one of the main uh, characteristics of this uh, of this kind of torite. We could also apply by the other side or entering, please stay on this, this position. From here, the same idea, enter Jimen here, Jimen in this case for choking, 
I'm from here, reversely to what we have, uh, we have done in the in the in the past technique. We don't step here, but we step on the other side. As you as you can see, I'm from here, going and having this control. We have here, of course, we could restrain um, performing the Hojo Jutsu on this circumstance. This is very, very painful. This technique could be also uh, a performer approaching by the side or approaching by the back side, approaching by the back. But also we could cover other techniques in that cases, for example, in those cases, sorry. Uh, Tom? When we are going on the back side, what we would perform is having this control and striking. This is because uh, we will strike on the, uh, on the, uh, here on the shoulder with the idea to break the clavicula. And from here we go, after breaking the clavicula here, having this control on this hand here. This go make hair to put to that side and from here we could have this control and from here we have sorry this control here or of course having this this control here making or an extension or a flexion of the of the neck and from here of course grabbing one bending and having the control here to end and restraining with the Hoyo Jutsu at the end. This hard explanation or a basic level, a basic concept of this advanced study tape called Yo So Jime. I hope that you have enjoyed. It's a very precious study, a very deep knowledge about our tradition. And please keep watching our videos. See you on next time. Goodbye and thank you.